hello everyone so welcome back to another tutorial so this time I am going to do a VR shooting tutorial so these days I had a VR headset with me and so I thought of testing some VR stuff so first part so this tutorial series will contain three parts the first part would be how to grab this gun so as you can see here when I, uh, I can grab the gun and you can see the hand is fit to the gun as I am holding a real gun and also the next part is shooting with the gun so when I shoot the gun there will be a muscle flash and also in this place I hit there will be decals also if I uh, shoot on the bottles they will be broken into pieces uh, so yeah first part is grabbing the gun and next part is shooting mechanics and the third part is this uh, destructible bottles so the, those are the things I'm gonna cover and this is the final demo of what I could implement I'm trying really hard to aim there okay this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me okay so far in the project we can grab the gun and shoot the gun and also these boxes react to the gun bullets and also in the point where the bullet hits there will be a particle and also a decal so today I want to work on these uh, bottle objects when the bullet hit by uh, this bottle is hit by a bullet they should be broken into pieces so to implement that Mm -hmm. here this is my bottle mesh we can break the mesh so to do that uh, we have to enable distractions there should be this right let's try this apex destructions okay i had to restart the project to apply the settings now let's go here now we can create destructible mesh like this okay and then Oh, we can change the settings here. Fracture. Now it is fracturing. And it looks like the engine is stuck, but I guess it will come back. Alright. Now when I fracture, it is like this. okay that's good enough now how to use this fractured mesh let's see let's place it like this now if I select this is the normal mesh if I select this destructible mesh there should be some settings for regarding the damage
right uh, let's do something like this and BP uh, we can create double print let's call it BP destructible and just like this uh, let me copy all these events and also I'm going to implement this pickup actor interface here like this and here I'm going to paste all those events and so instead of this one I'm going to drag and drop this destructible mesh right now it's there and instead of static mesh component I'm going to use this you don't need this okay so do we have damage level or something here right let's test and see what happens now Well, it still doesn't work. Mm. I think we have ah uh, right. Uh, there is another function. Apply damage right now from this one we can actually apply some damage to this so damage amount I don't know let's try 100 impulse strength also 100 impulse direction this or oh, hit location 
we don't have an input so therefore I'll just get that the location and use it right and now let's test And it worked okay so that uh, I think that would be enough uh, so no we can add some sound effects also right I imported this sound uh, do we have attenuation to this okay let's apply that attenuation that should be all right okay let's do the final test now For some reason my controller are not working. okay so that's all for today and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patreon club link would be in the description below and thanks for watching so the project files will be available through the patreon page as well like always and see you in the next episode goodbye